this is Lomi and in this video I'm sharing information on common types of paint thinners and what they do. I'll be demonstrating a few different types I'm frequently asked about. One is Liquitex Matte Medium which is also used as a sealant. One is Liquitex Flow Aid. Flow Aid shouldn't be used straight. The instructions say to mix it with water in a 20 to run ratio. For this video I've already mixed mine. Last is water. Regular tap water is fine for hand painting, but with an airbrush you'll want to use distilled water. So let's get started. We'll use the plain water first. It's the best option for most artists as it's readily available and gives good results. No matter what you're thinning with, you want your paint to have an inky consistency, almost like watercolor paint, but not as thin as what you'd use if you were airbrushing. When it's properly thinned, black paint will look more like a gray wash. Water gives good, thin lines with a bit of opacity, which means you might need to build up intense colors with a few strokes. But as you can see, it's easy to get great results with water alone. Next up is our Flowade mixed with water. Flowade is best for several reasons. For one, it doesn't reduce the opacity as much. It makes it harder to find the right consistency since the color stays intense, but it means you'll never need to go over any lines a second time. It also slows drying time so it's easier to clean up mistakes, and it reduces surface tension making lines even finer than with water. All of these brush strokes are done with the same pressure I used with the water. You can see they're much finer. Last up is the medium. People ask about this as a thinner all the time and I'm only including it to show why it's not a good option for thinning paints. Acrylic medium is just paint without pigment, so when you thin with medium, it will increase opacity and slow down drying times, but it won't change the consistency of the paint. It stays thick and gloppy and makes fine lines simply impossible. Medium has its uses for face-ups, of course, but thinning paint isn't one of them. So for a quick recap, Water is a great all-around thinner, but Flowade gives finer lines and more intense color. Medium will reduce the opacity of paint and slow down drawing times, but it doesn't actually thin it, so it's best kept for other purposes. That's all for today. I hope you found this video useful, and if you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comment box below. Thanks for watching. See you next time!